Okay, Tim, you must be disappointed with them ending with I men. <laughs> well, I'm disappointed, yeah, everyone's disappointed to be fair. Um, I thought I thought we did well, we did a bit better, we battled well, I suppose, but um, we just needed the ball to drop. It seems, I don't know, it just wouldn't drop for us in the area. Um, we had a few cleared off the line, bouncing in the, in the uh, penalty box, but it wouldn't, it wouldn't drop for us. The lads were really disappointed in there, but I thought overall it was a battling performance, to say the least. You were comfortable, weren't you? you didn't, Hayes didn't really threaten you too much. Well, I've just said to John Danby there, have you made a shot, uh, had a shot to save? He's not had a shot to save. Um, one of the quietest games I'll ever have, but we need that extra little bit of quality to break them down. Whether we've got it, I'm not sure. It's just frustrating for you as well. Obviously, you had to make a couple of quick substitutions in the second period, but there wasn't an awful lot to change, was it? Yeah, um, substitutions were forced, to be honest. Uh, I thought Sean Kelly had the best game we've had. It's how he played at Wrexham, and he played well. Uh, I said to him, be on your front foot, because obviously I weren't playing and he needed someone to talk at the back. I thought he did okay, and then he's hurt his ankle, but I thought Christian Platt, who come on, did well as well. Um, but yeah, I mean, it's hard to say, hard to put your finger on things. And it's be really frustrating for you, as a, obviously a caretaker manager nowadays, to see that, having them with nine men, but also, you know, you just couldn't break them down, could you at all? Well, that's what I say, I mean, when they went to ten, I thought I was happy, when they went to nine, I thought, oh, no, because it was obvious they were going to put five or six behind the ball. And, and, like I say, it's one of them we've got enough quality to maybe break them down. Like I say, we, on another day we might have got four at the end, but they were never going to score. It was, it was up to us to score and we couldn't do it today. And they didn't seem to force a play, did they, Chester, until about injury time when the board went up and suddenly they started getting forward and started to create a few chances and problems. I don't know about force a play. I think we were, like you say, very comfortable. Um, it was just a matter of... I mean, the wind was changing, the wind was howling. It's not excuses, but... I thought we passed it a little bit better, we had a little bit of a diamond in the field, we passed it with Anthony Barry got on the ball, the first half at the bar. Like I say, on another day I think we could have got a few goals. Unfortunately though, it's not points we need, is it? It's three points we need to get out of the predicament we're in. Well, it's definitely, like you say, I mean, it's two dropped again today, because no disrespect to Hayes, not, I think they're the worst team we've played. Um, but we'll keep fighting, that's it, that's all. I don't know what else to say, to be honest. And next up, I suppose, is you speak to the chairman and see what the score is. Well, I mean, the chairman just said to me, do training uh, Thursday, Friday, which I love love doing. Um, I really enjoyed today. Whether it's the last time I do it, I don't know. It depends what the chairman's got in line. Obviously, come Monday, he could have a manager in line, I don't know. But as long as he asks me to do it, I'll enjoy doing it and give it me all. And obviously, a week to prepare now. We haven't got any Tuesday games. We've had quite a long period, haven't we, of playing Saturday, Tuesday or Sunday, Tuesday. A week to prepare for Russian and Diamonds at home. Well, that's what I mean. That's what the lads have just said there. He's, um, for for the second half, the latter of the week, we've not had a manager, um, so people have been up in arms, well not up in arms, but here and there and not knowing where they are really I suppose. I had to pick the team, what the chairman asked me to do, um, I still think with the players we've got was the best team I could have picked. Um, so I mean, with a week's training under belt, maybe get one or two players in, we could be a little bit stronger come Saturday. I was going to say, obviously, somewhat hampered now, aren't you, with a couple of injuries picked up today. We do need a couple of players being coming, don't we? But is that a realistic opportunity, do you think? Well, I mean, you won't ask the chairman that, not me. I mean, it's not the early doors for me, but um, I think, obviously, we've got an injury. Um, Tuesday night, we've got an injury today, both ankles. So, I mean, we're down to bare bones, but can we bring players in? You need to ask the chairman. And if it is the case that you stay on, how do you fancy player manager? Yeah, I love it. I mean, to be fair, I'd love some of them young lads to stop me playing. I'd love that. Um, but like I say, the two centre-halves did OK today, but I'd love them to stop me playing because I enjoy being on the sideline, I enjoy coaching. It's what I want to do in the future. Um, whether it's now, now's the time, I don't know, but if I'm playing Saturday and not managing, then I'll be out there giving me all as captain. OK. Cheers, Tim. Cheers, Tim.